All sweaty, there you go. Hello, welcome to my show. Uh, this is a bit where, hold on, let me see if we can adjust this better. Can you get a bit of view of where we It's Dave Crane here from Tibber Charger Brand TV. Just raging it. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to introduce you to who I am, what we do, and hopefully have fun. I'm not going to take my eyes off the road before anybody says irresponsible. But the deal is this. I get stuck in the car, in traffic, in, in the UAE, on average, I would say about um, three hours a day. Something like that. Um, part of it is heading back to Sharjah, uh, and part of it is just basically driving on for meetings and so on. Conservatively, about three to four hours, uh, and sometimes it might be six hours depending on where it is I'm travelling to go and see. So during that time I thought, well why not actually set it up in podcast, or videocast, or periscope live from a car? Because that way people can actually connect with you, and they can see what it's like to be really stressed out. If I'm sweating, it's not because I'm naturally sweaty man, my dear problem. Um, it's because I've just been playing foosball, um, just before I left my meeting. Because sometimes you just gotta, you know, knock your balls. So here we are, and if you have no idea who I am, um, I'm going to have a TV show called Turbo Charge Your Brand TV. And it's all about branding, it's all about the way that you create your business, it's all about how to get your head to, to move forward by creating things around you, uh, using the facilities that you have. So in terms of business, it gives you tips and tricks for the get of sales, uh, looking after customers better, and also uh, it all starts in their mind. So we start off looking at mindset because I'm a practice therapist, life coach, and um, also a practitioner. So a lot of the stuff that I say is heavily loaded to get the very best effect. Uh, and if you're thinking of hypnosis, did you just say hypnosis? Yes, I did. Uh, I'm a hypnotherapist and I do stage hypnosis shows. And you might say, that's utter rubbish. What's all that about? Well, all you need to do is go into my website, go into, um, well, go into YouTube for a start, and uh, check out Hypno Coach, the uh, uh, channel. That's my web channel. You see lots of stuff in there about hypnosis and so on, uh, which should hopefully make you go Boo! like Scooby Doo, and make you realise that uh, there's a lot more interesting things out there that some people don't know about. Mm. What I suggest though is always keeping an open mind. That's what I attempt to do as often as possible. If anything I'm not sure about, I always think, well, let's. I'll, I'm not sure. I'll disbelieve. Well, we'll actually make any comments. I'll actually, I've tried it myself, and uh, many things I've tried. Oh my God, my goodness, that actually works. Things like energy healing, healing. You know, some people do Reiki, I've done energy healing. I found some effects from it. Uh, stuff I can't explain, but I do. That one of the key things to it is if you can do it over and over again, and it works every time, then you've probably got a system. And if it's a system, that's provable by science, and therefore that's how I tend to work with things. Um, when it comes to hypnosis, the question's always there. Well, you're not going to work on me. Well, probably not, because if you resist it, it it's all self-hypnosis. So when I get people out of the audience and say, right, get hypnotized, um, if they decide to sort of plug in and go, I'm not doing it, I'm not doing it, they're going to end up not being hypnotized. Now I realise that as I'm speaking now, I'm probably going a bit fast, so I should slow it all down. There is, I go into open road. I should slow down where so everybody else can go, ah, that's what he's saying. That's what I was saying. So, what's Turbo Charge Your Brand TV all about? Well, if you go to the site, Turbo Charge Your Brand Dot TV. You'll find that I've done a couple of seasons, some of the seasons I've done all sorts, from chatting to cheerleaders to uh, interviewing key most minds in business development and personal developments, including Jack Canfield, Brian Tracy, um, Dr. John Gray, Alan Pease, Rick Robbins, um, just just a whole t ton of people, and you'll you recognise a lot of them, especially when you see the new season with guys like Joel Bauer and Perry Marshall, who've come on board as well as uh, guests on the show. Uh, we've got quite a few actually, which you haven't set, but looking forward to sharing with you in the coming uh, weeks. So if you get all this stuff on a regular basis, well, I'm planning to do this every day. In fact, I'm planning to do it every morning after dropping my beautiful five-year-old Maya off from school because the traffic on a morning is nasty. It's slow, so I tend to be walking at low. You know, not walking, but I could probably go faster walking at a snail's pace. So it makes more sense to actually go and cry, hold on, where are we? What are we going to do? How are we going to move faster? Uh, and uh, what should we talk about? So every morning around about 8 o'clock, I should be able to give you a podcast live. Probably about 5, 10 minutes of my thoughts of the day. And the plan was do the same thing on the way back every day. But here's the problem. On the way back, it's usually dark. So on the way back, all you see is going past, and uh, and you'll hear some bad words coming out. So I'm not quite ready because if I put a light on inside our, all that means is that uh, with this light on, I won't see anything. So we'll come to a halt very 
hypothetically, probably with me being wrapped around a tree or something equally un inconvenient. So, at the same time, as we're driving along, welcome to Dubai. On the left-hand side of me, which probably looks like the right for you, I can see the Burj Khalifa, which is probably one of the most iconic buildings in the world, which it should be, because it's the tallest building in the world. For now, sorry, burping. That's really sexy on a, <laughs> a podcast. Hey, who's Dave Crane? Oh, he looks like a, a Rastafarian Bob Marley type. Lives in Dubai. Um, speaks like somebody from the north of England and burps all the way through his vodcast. Really? Is, is that kind of cool to watch? Well, if only he didn't burp, it'd look cheap and it makes him look like he can't digest his dinner properly. Well, so they have it full frontal burping. So, um, yeah, in Dubai we've got so many iconic elements that people want to come here. I've been here, believe it or not, 22 years. 22 years? Who would be 22 years? Everybody. Because the thing is, as soon as you get here, it's really hard to leave. Right now, you just arrive and you go, oh no, that's not going to catch on. That'll never be a big thing. But before you know it actually is, it gets bigger and better every single time. And I'll be sharing things, an insider's view of Dubai, um, which uh, hopefully we'll be able to have a lot of fun with. Um, but one of the things I say about this is, I actually feel more at home here, which I would do after 22 years, I feel more at home here than I do in my own home country, and that's the okay. case. Whenever I go back to see my folks, that's great, seeing old family and friends, great. But uh, it just doesn't feel the same. Because this obviously feels like home, and whenever I travel, I look for a new place to go, and uh, there's never anything quite like this. So, that's it really. So I'm going to cut it short here, because I realise that the battery might be going on my phone. I want to keep it as intact as possible. I might come back to you with more broadcasts later. But meanwhile, feel free to leave some comments. I'd love to hear from you. And uh, take it easy. My name is Dave Craig. This is Turbo Charge, your brand, daily. Don't drive like that, you idiot. What do you think I'm going to do? Goodness, be good to yourself.